MustangMedic.com. We show you everything from point A to point B, day one to day sold. So enjoy and thanks for watching. <laughs> MustangMedic.com The 1971 Mustang Fastback Restoration Project. Yeah! <laughs> Holly 770 Street Avenger. Going back on to a rightful place. Got the gasket in place right there. Wheels, you'd be proud of me. Got some grade 8 bolts to secure her down onto her new. Uh, is it Wyland? Is that how it's pronounced? Pete? Wyland? Wyland. Wyland? You're guessing too, aren't you? Wyland, Wyland. <laughs> Alright. Um, and here we go. Four more bolts. This bad boy's got a carburetor and a bad boy intake on a rebuilt 429. See, are these bolts long enough? I don't know if they're long enough. Think they're long enough? They look like they're catching the red, dude. Aluminum, though, I want to be careful about that. I might get longer. I think I'm going to longer ones. I'm going to, I'm going to add, I'm going to add a uh, quarter inch on these grade eights. I don't, I don't, I'm not comfortable with just like four threads. I want more to secure it. So I'm going to stop right here. We'll do a little road trip to Lowe's. Get a couple more grade eights. <laughs> She's in. And man, is she bad. I mean, this carburetor, I'm a little concerned about hood clearance. I'm a little bit concerned. I mean, she, she does raise up in the center, but that darn carburetor, this, this much is, is higher than this. Yeah, it is. Mm -hmm. That's the issue. I got a pretty high carburetor right now. So... What we're looking at is from here to here to there, and she's sitting up high on this massive intake. So, um, Mustang Medic Alert. Am I going to have issues with this 8012 um, Wheeling Stealth, which is kind of funny, it's called Stealth when it's so darn big, <laughs> intake with this Holly 770 carburetor on this... Uh, on this uh, this hood. Look at that. Yeah, look at that. Here, get down there. Get down there and shoot to this angle. Mm -hmm. So that carburetor is right there. So we might have to put the hood on her and see how close we are because uh, it's going to be tight. It's always something. <laughs> but uh, we'll figure it out. They, uh, geez, dude, they did say. <laughs> they did say that uh, this will work on, well, 429, so it's not necessarily spec to a uh, 71 Mach 1. So I hope we don't have hood issues. We'll see. Maybe put an air cleaner on that bad boy and it's up here. It's going to be like up here. The air cleaner. How high does that hood go up? Oh, it goes up pretty high. Ay, ay, ay. Fitting this, fitting this Ram Air in here is going to be a bit of a challenge. We'll see. But, carburetor's on. Engine's in. Woohoo! Thanks for watching, guys. Thanks for watching. Bye, Pete. MustangMedic.com Please look for the link in the description below for the next in our series. If it's not there, come back soon. MustangMedic.com